<laughs> hey, it's Sue in the restricted section. Um, today I thought I would finally get around to doing the furry friend tag. Uh, this is obviously not book related. I'm just going to tell you about my pets. I have no idea who originally did this tag. It's just in the wind. But Megan did this one a few months back, and I'll link her video down below if you want to check it out. She talked about her two dogs, Murphy and Sasha. You've probably seen both of them on the channel before, especially Murphy. He likes to uh, make little cameos in our videos a lot. But I have a dog and a cat, so I'm going to talk about uh, my firstborn first. So come here, Wiggles. Come here. Hopefully they'll cooperate. I don't know. But this is Caligula, and that's the first question of the tag, is what is your pet's name? Caligula, yes, after the uh, demented Roman emperor. My sweet boy. What breed is your pet? Stop licking my hand. It has. I just put lotion on. Why do dogs love licking lotion? It can't taste good. But uh, what breed is your pet? He's, he's, we usually just call him a terrier mix. Um, his mother was a Morky, so he's at least... Ha or at least a quarter uh, Yorkie and a quarter Maltese. And then we don't know what his father was. Um, probably some other kind of terrier based on how much terrier he uh, looks. Next question. How long have you had your pet? Probably a little over seven years. What's wrong with your ears? Are they itchy? He needs groomed. He's getting groomed tomorrow actually. His hair's gotten pretty long. How did you get your pet? My boyfriend's ex-roommate had his mom and uh, her two puppies, him and his sister, and uh, I just, I fell in love with him. He was just this fat little brown puppy and I had to have him and so his roommate gave him to us. How old is your pet? He is seven and a few months. What are some quirky things about your pet's personality? I don't know. Khalil is not super quirky. He's he's kind of just a typical dog, I think. Um, he jumps like a fucking kangaroo. He's got long legs. And he can jump really high. He likes to burrow under the blankets, which I think a lot of dogs do. But he likes to sleep wedged right beside me. He doesn't really like to sleep on my lap or on top of me that much, but he will always wedge himself <laughs> beside me as close as he can get and often burrow under the covers up beside me. What else is quirky about you? He doesn't like bones, which is weird. He doesn't like chewing bones. He just leaves them sitting there. Doesn't care about them. I don't know. He's he's your pretty pretty typical dog. He's not I've had a lot of people who cuz a lot of people don't like small dogs. But I've had a lot of people tell me that he's not as annoying <laughs> as most small dogs because he, he barks sometimes, but most of the time he's, he's pretty good about not being yappy. He gets barky around the middle of the day because he hates the male lady, like most dogs hate the male person. And uh, oh, my cat probably just broke something. It's cool. Um, she probably will not sit here like he is <laughs> right now with me especially since she's in like playful mode right now so she might scratch my face off we'll see um <laughs> he's being so good right now uh yeah he's not like super quirky though um what does your relationship with your pet mean to you Caligula's my little baby he's probably pets are probably the only children I'll ever have so <laughs> yeah he's he's my He's my fur baby, my child. Um, <laughs> what are some of your favorite pastimes with your pet? Just anything, really. We like cuddling on the couch. Like I said, he doesn't really sleep on me, but he cuddles up beside me. Um, we play sort of fetch. He's not. He doesn't like bringing things back. He wants me to chase him around and try to get it away from him, so... We play, I throw things, he gets them, and then I chase him to try and get it back from him. What else do we do? We go for walks, but he's not, he's not the best on walks, honestly, because 
I think he just needs a leash trained better, but he gets aggressive, like if we meet other dogs. Normally he's super friendly if he's not on a leash out on a walk, but when we're out on walks, he's aggressive to other dogs and people. <laughs> I don't know, I think he tries to protect me because this little 10 pound monster thinks that he's um, dominant over me, I'm pretty sure. So, let's see, last question. My cat's going nuts in there. What nicknames do you have for your pet? Um, I call him Quiggles. A lot of the time uh, that came about because my best friend's daughter when she was much younger couldn't say Caligula and so she'd say Quigla and so I started calling him Quigla sometimes because I thought it was cute that she said that and then that turned into Quiggles um, I also call him Quiggle Bear I call him sweet boy a lot I call him a sweet boy yeah that's pretty much it I think um, but that's Caligula. Here he is. He's in his little hoodie right now. Um, I like to, I mean, he only wears sweaters in the winter time and I, I like to say it's because he's cold and needs them, but really I just think he looks cute in sweaters, but I don't have an excuse to put them on him in summertime. <laughs> so let me go find my cat and see if she'll at least cooperate for a few seconds so that you guys can, you know, see her. Alright, so this is my kitty and she's already wanting down <laughs> maybe I'll uh can you be cooperative she's gonna she just wants to play right now but this is Liliana is her name and she is named after a necromancer or something from Magic the Gathering why did I let my boyfriend name both of my pets I don't know. What breed is she? I'm just gonna let her go. Maybe I'll put I'll put some footage at the end of her playing or something. Maybe I'll put her playing with her dick toy. I got her a toy for Christmas that it looks like a penis. But what breed is she? I don't know what her cat breeds. I think she's kind of stripy. Tabby? She's like a gray tabby, but she's also splotchy. She has orange splotches on her, but I don't know. She's a cat. How long have I had her? A little over a year, like a year and three months. How did you get your pet? Uh, my sister gave her to me. She found her in a bush outside of her house and fished her out of there and was going to keep her herself, but she had just gotten a puppy uh, who she was training to be like a show dog. It's a Bouvier. And uh, the cat, Lily, was interfering with the training of the dog. So she um, gave the cat to me. Um, how old is she? She's a little over a year. What are some quirky things about her personality? Again, I feel like Lily is pretty much your typical cat. She likes to, she's pretty rambunctious. Um, she's definitely not a lazy cat. She likes to knock things off of all surfaces, especially my bookshelves and my makeup desk. She gets up there and just just knocks shit in the floor. Um, she likes to, she gets fixated on things on the wall. She hasn't done this in a while, but she used to get like really fixated on like a spot on the wall if there was just like, like there was a dent in the wall beside my front door and she fucking tore at that and the wall is like fucked up now. I'll put a picture in so you can see the destruction she wrought there. She actually does get cuddly. She will sleep on me a lot when she's not being vicious and scratching the shit out of me. Um, when she gets sleepy she'll she'll lay down on me and cuddle up and it's sweet. It makes up for all the all the crap. <laughs> <laughs> she does the rest of the time. Do you want to say hi some more? You seem like you've calmed down. Nope. Nope. <laughs> she loves playing laser just like most cats. Caligula, however, gives no fucks about the laser. He does not get care at all. But Lily loves it. What does your relationship with your pet mean to you? Again, she's my baby. Like, even though she injures me bodily <laughs> from time to time. She is my sweet baby and I love her. What are some of your favorite pastimes? Um, we play laser, like I said. Um, play with her little, it's a fishing pole toy. 
Um, we also cuddle on the couch. She'll sleep on me while I read. Caligula will be pressed up against me and Lily will be laying on top of me while I read. And lastly, what nicknames do you have for your pet? Lily, we call her Lily most of the time, which is a nickname. Her full name is Liliana. I call her baby girl a lot. Um, I call her sweet girl, just like I call Caligula sweet boy, even though she's not really a sweet girl most of the time. Um, so yeah, those are, that's Caligula and Lily, my babies. Um, yeah, like I said, I'll try to put some footage in the end here of like, maybe them both playing. They don't play together a whole lot. I think they just can't really figure out how to play together because, you know, one's a dog and one's a cat and it just doesn't work out. They get along all right most of the time. Uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, I'm not going to tag anyone specifically, but I'd love to hear about your pets if you want to do this tag. There'll be links below where you can find myself and Megan other places on the internet. If you have not subscribed yet, please do, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bring here, Quiggles. Bring here. Bring here. You didn't bring here at all. Come here, Quiggles. <laughs>